Mark Wahlberg is a Hollywood fitness icon. He's now 50 with four kids. He's still training twice a day, still a member of the 4am workout club and is looking better than ever. So what's Mark Wahlberg's secret for staying in such amazing shape? Is it his consistent hard work and cutting edge line of fitness supplements like he claims? Or is there something else he's using behind the scenes that's the secret to his unreal physique? I'm Paris Demers, a full-time personal trainer and online coach. And in this video, I'm gonna break down Mark Wahlberg's fitness routine. And I'll be telling you why you likely won't get the same results as him, even if you do everything he's promoting. While we don't have confirmation on the exact program Mark used for Uncharted, there are plenty of interviews and articles on his training around the time Uncharted started filming. So that's where I'll be getting most of the information for this video. Mark has been working out with trainer Brian Nguyen for over a decade now. Brian is all about functional full body training focused around keeping Mark athletic, injury free, and of course, nice and shredded. In the time leading up to Uncharted, Mark Wahlberg was training five days a week with two days off to let his body recover. In a bodybuilding.com video released in April, 2020, which is right around the time Uncharted started filming, Brian said that Mark's most recent training program had seen Mark getting much better results much faster than his previous programs, even though his training and diet was largely the same. So what made such a big difference? Well, according to Brian, Mark was seeing such amazing results because of Mark's new line of fitness supplements. Now, I have a little bit of trouble believing this to be the truth. As Brian and Mark stated in the same video, that his training and diet were already on point, and if your diet is perfect, there's very few supplements that will actually be of any use to you. As supplements are meant to be just that, supplements to your diet that help you make up for any macro or micronutrient deficiencies that you might have. And most of the supplements that Mark sells are these kind of dietary supplements, like protein powder, energy bars, and branch chain amino acids. They're there to supplement things that are already in your diet. So if your diet is perfect, you'd have no use for them. I'm not saying these supplements aren't useful, but if your diet is already perfect and you're getting all the nutrients you need from real foods, then you won't suddenly start seeing amazing results just by adding products like this to your diet. Now the two standout fitness supplements that are actually very well researched and well regarded for their ability to actually help you see results are creatine and caffeine. But obviously people have been using these for years, so I doubt that Mark just started using these a couple years ago. So Mark is clearly just attributing his results to his new line of supplements so that he can boost sales. Now he isn't the first person to use his impressive physique and fitness icon status to sell supplements, but there's something he's not telling you that makes the way he's promoting his supplements incredibly dishonest and manipulative. But before we do that, let's take a deeper dive into his training. Mark's training will vary depending on the role that he's prepping for. For example, when he was prepping for 2013's no pain, no gain, he was doing mostly classic bodybuilding training, centered mostly around machines and isolation exercises. But while prepping for the Uncharted movies, his workouts consisted of high volume, complex exercises. An example of this kind of exercise would be doing reverse lunges while doing battle ropes, or a step up into a bicep curl into an overhead press. Complex exercises are essentially just taking multiple exercises and putting them together. So they would take two of these exercises and superset them together with some skipping or some biking done in between. Now this type of training is amazing if you want to get super lean, improve your cardiovascular health, and build a small amount of muscle, but you won't build a body like Mark's with exercises like these. And there's two main reasons for this. To perform these complex exercises, you'll need to use loads much lighter than what you could handle if you were just focusing on one movement at a time. Along with this, it's very difficult to maintain a good mind-muscle connection because you're constantly either switching between movements or trying to focus on multiple movements at once. And for reason number two, because you're working on your cardiovascular work and your strength training at the same time, you'll run into something called the interference effect. The interference effect is a phenomenon where if you do your strength training and your endurance training at the same time, your body has a diminished ability to adapt to either one, meaning your results will be less impressive than if you just did one or the other. This just means if you're doing a lot of cardio along with your resistance training, you won't be able to build as much muscle as efficiently as if you just did the strength training on its own. So now that we've laid everything out, let's bring it all together. Mark Wahlberg looks better than most serious bodybuilders that are in their mid 20s, despite the fact that he's now 50 with four kids and a very busy work schedule. He attributes his results all to hard work, smart training, and his own line of supplements, but his training is subpar when it comes to building and maintaining such a large amount of muscle mass, and his supplements are nothing special, especially considering his diet is already dialed in. So let me tell you what I think is going on here. Most likely, Mark Wahlberg is undergoing testosterone replacement therapy, which brings his testosterone levels up to those of a 20-year-old with high normal testosterone. This allows him to maintain an insane amount of muscle mass for a 50-year-old, all while being incredibly lean. He then takes advantage of the people who look up to him by saying all his results come from years of hard work and now from his own brand of supplements. Essentially indirectly saying you can get results like him if you just train hard like he does and buy his supplements. Long story short, be highly skeptical of the claims made by anyone who is financially motivated for those claims to be true. You don't need to buy anything fancy to get amazing results. Just train specifically for the goal
goals that you have, try to get all your macro and micronutrients from whole food sources and make sure to get plenty of sleep. Then once you're doing all that, if you want to invest in something like creatine or pre-workout, go for it. But don't let anyone trick you into thinking they have some sort of secret all natural product that will give you huge gains in the gym out of nowhere. Now, if you want to learn about a celebrity with a little bit more integrity, go check out my video on Charlie Cox and his workout for Daredevil.